How's it going, guys? Siphon here, and welcome back to more Life is Strange. Yes, I could not let this game go. Uh, continuing with episode two. Um, last time we were got into a situation with our principal, got suspended from Blackwell. David's moving in. Oh, fuck shit. And now we have to get a battery for the truck. So let's do that. Um, apparently I gotta check one of those car hoods. What if my dad's vehicle actually has the thing no, underneath it? Not going over there. No, it didn't. It doesn't have the. No, okay. I thought it would have. I didn't know. Um, we gotta look for a battery. For okay, can we climb that? Hmm. Is it sturdy enough? Don't just jump up there if you can't climb. The upper body strength. She needs to work on that. <laughs> Damn, you cigarettes. Shouldn't do drugs, y'all. That's take right there. She can't climb it. Uh, or maybe she could prop this up and climb. Yeah. Can you lift that? That's kind of better, but kind of unstable. I don't know how unstable pallets can be. Well, I guess that's a little bit better help than it is with jumping up normally. Okay. Shit. Is that fire still going on? Well, damn, it sure is. Okay. Graffiti. What do I want to tell my fellow sailors of the seven trash heaps? <laughs> Bury treasure. Got it. Radical pirata piratical. I like what they did there. Did it work? Aha! Uh -huh. Very treasure. Alright, uh what's this? Can we climb even higher? There's that fire. It's still going. I can't believe Rachel set that fire. Oh my goodness. I don't think she meant to, but I also don't think she didn't mean to. Pretty much. Crazy that something so destructive can also be so... Beautiful. Uh huh. Or a fire that began in a trash can could grow to light up the entire sky. A simple thing like that, y'all. That's why you should be careful. Throw out your trash. Don't in smoke in the forest. Fire. Pretty. Sweet. Sweet. What? It's all fun and games till this guy enslaves everyone. Or a robot? Yeah, I don't believe. I don't. A. What? What is that? These magazines are so gross. Who would look at this? Uh, somebody who wants a good time that can't get it anywhere else, probably. What's that? A fire poker? I know one fire that doesn't need any poking. Yeah, the one that's all over the freaking forest. Okay, um, I don't see another car enabling me to... I mean, that's Dad's car. Is that a Dad's car? No, I can't. You can't. But it could have a battery in there, though. A shoebox? Watch a rat come out. Oh. Woo! Okay, we'll take that. Why not? I mean, it's a junkyard. Nobody wants it. It's someone else's junk. It's someone else's treasure. I always wanted a pet snake. Instead, I got David. Oh. Fuck everything. <laughs> what? <laughs> That's kind of messed up. Okay. Let's, maybe this truck, because this truck right here is, like, really lit. Hold on. Open that hood. What are you trying to hide under there, hood? Can't open it. Damn. Hmm. Oh, there's a trunk button right there. Pull that hatch. What are you trying to hide under there? I didn't mean to do that again. 
Okay. There we go. Now, does it have a battery? That truck looks clean. I would have taken that truck. I mean, the other one doesn't even look that clean. Look how clean this shit is. Like, look over here. Like, I mean, okay, it's missing the door. Okay, but it's, it's, I mean, it's better. Doesn't it look better? I mean, I'm just saying, is that a police notice? Wow. <laughs> oh. Shitty ride, drug dealer. I really thought crime paid better. Uh, warning, this vehicle has been seized and impounded in execution of a warrant order. This vehicle is restrained and impounded in accordance with the authority provided by Rule 42 of their Oregon Magistrates Court Rules in Pursuance of Section 2-1 of the Narcotics Damage Act of 1985. It is an offense to who lawful excuse destroy, damage, or tamper with this property. Okie dokie. Well, I'm just going to take its battery because I'm sure it's fine. Careful. This girl's handy with vehicles. I should get her to fix my car. Here we go. Okay. The pick of the litter. It sure is. Ain't that heavy? And she just puts it in her pocket. I don't. <laughs> okay. Um. That's that. We got the battery. So let's just go. Shit. Let's get the fuck out of here. There it is. All right. Let's make this battery. Put this battery in. Connect it. By the way, y'all, it's not like Legos. You don't just put something there. Connect it. You gotta. Do a couple of core kits. I'm sure it's heavy though. Woo! Be careful. She's really handy. But you don't have a key, so how are you going to start it? It's... Conveniently, that screwdriver can crank the car up. Damn. This thing... Needs more love than I can give right now. In the meantime, maybe I can spruce it up a bit. Probably. Oh, someone's texting me. I don't suck. You really, really don't. My mom thinks I do. I don't know if I can stand going home tonight. Still there? I'm grabbing something from home, then I'll meet you at the junkyard. See you really soon. You better. Okay. I think my mom messaged me too. To represent my functionality. Go to the weekend. Okay, well, that's a text message. Fire update. Okay. Elliot. Spanish test sucked. Luckily, if I pass, no, I think I did. What you up to? Not much. Got shit to do later. All this stuff. Hey, after Tempest, you want to hang out? mom okay i didn't think like that he asked you to empty your pockets and then you were completely innocent oh can't you just forget about david for a second think about me i just need some space okay maybe i need my daughter back it's really sad while an escape hatch could be nice i should probably cover over this massive hole Mm-hmm. a torn seat Probably a good idea to cover over this with something. Maybe the pirate thingy, probably. I know someone who would be very happy here. My singing man! Put him up there, put him up there. What? Okay. You can hang here, but I get to pick the tunes. Okay? Good talk. Good talk. That's what's up. A broken bowl. I seen Maybe a light bulb. Another light bulb I can put in here. I found that. So we're gonna go around the junkyard and find the things to do this. I don't think I found any of the stuff for the rusted floorboard and the seats yet. But I'm gonna. I know I seen a light bulb by the battery, so we probably can get that real quick. A beach towel. Okay. This could cover that torn seat and look awesome doing it. So colorful. Put in the inventory. Okay. Okay. So we got stuff for the seat. Um, there's a light bulb I told y'all about right here. 
You might not work. Then again, I hardly ever work. She's very handy. I wouldn't be touching any of that shit. First of all, you don't know where it's been. It's dirty. Could probably get you to some shit. Like, she's very brave. Okay, let's find something to... F a syringe. Here's a side of Arcadia Bay they don't put on the postcards. <laughs> yeah, the drug side. Uh, I don't see anything that could help with the... Wait, wait, what's that? A welcome mat? Yeah! Okay, you put that in your inventory. Cover that life endangering floor hole quite nicely. Yeah. Okay, so we got three things that we need, and I think that's really all we need to spruce up that vehicle so we could go driving. I'm excited about that. Mostly because I played the first one, so it's like now I know to see how that car came to be. You know. Okay, hold on. It was just a normal like garbage car, like. I knew it wasn't nothing special, but I thought maybe she got it from her birthday or something, but... Shit, alright. Fix. Let's put that placemat over. It's gonna take more than a placemat, because, I mean, it could move and shit, but hey. I mean, not like nobody can fall. Did it work? I mean, it ain't perfect, but I mean, what can you expect at a jump yard, you know? Okay. Put that towel on it. Yep. What? I was thinking that she was going to get the pirate map, but I guess this works too. It really does. That's a nice looking color. Um, there we go. Don't know if that works. This thing looks like a rusted out shopping cart. Probably. It probably drives like one too. That's if it ever does drive, which seems questionable. Interesting. Still, how sweet would that be? Yeah, because, I mean, money-wise, she's not going to afford no damn vehicle. She ain't got no money. But, you know, is that Rachel? Yeah. Frank, it's Frank. Oh. Hello. Hey, Frank. What's up? Yeah, just... Checking in to see how you're doing. Really? Why? No. Listen, we've got some business to discuss. Where can we meet? What about? Oh, like drugs? Right. I'm hanging out in the junkyard north of town. The junkyard. That's great. Stay there. I'll see you soon. Okay. And Frank? Uh, is everything cool? I'm not in trouble or anything, right? I don't know. Did you do anything you should be in trouble for? <laughs> like, in general? Or to you? I'll see you soon. I don't trust that. But it's the homie Frank. He's not a bad guy. Maybe? I mean, I don't fucking know. <laughs> I don't remember. It's been so long since I played the first Life is Strange. Okay. Time for a hard-earned smoke break. Can, you, can that work? Turn that Does on. Does your truck look like an aquarium on wheels? <laughs> Didn't think so. You only get one chance to make a first expression. Hmm. Mystical. Let's make it mystical. She did say it was like a fish tank. The, the Illuminati symbols. The I sees all. Oh, the I see. What? Oh my God. Oh, jeez, Louise. Oh my God. Okay. Horn. Does the horn work? Honk. Does it work? It does. Singing man. Bobble. Does Principal Wells eat pizza with a fork and knife? Oh. I knew there was something off about that guy. Glove compartment? Hold on. This has a glove compartment? We never checked it? What is that? What do we have here? 
Oh. Take that. What is that? That looks like some kind of cloth? Yep. This'll do. What is that? What 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 is that though? I didn't know what it was. It looked like a shirt or something. In my own time. Eerie music. I'm trying to reach out. I know I'll get there soon. Okay. And we're walking around the edges. That fire's still going on. There's that damn crow again. The bad omen bird. There's some pretty ass birds though, honestly. They look terrifying if you look at them from a distance, but they're still nice cool birds. Everything's terrifying to me. Falling asleep, isn't she? Yep. Maybe. Yep. Are we not gonna see that guy again, are we? Oh, well, what is all this? The fuck? Uh, the shit. I slept all day. Uh, you don't see that? That flapping Illuminati shit? What the hell? The eye that sees all? My... Hold up. Um... There's that bad... Oh, every time some shit... Is that a raven? Is that those are crows or ravens? Cause I'm not sure, y'all. Please add to me in the comments below, like if that's a crow. I feel like it's a raven, cause it's way too big to be a crow. But crows aren't small either. So, ravens are also really pretty birds. Are we like near the fire, or is this a new fire? Uh, that's the homie. Her dad. dad? Her, her actual uh, biological father there. William. Is that his name? I think his name was William. Oh my god, why is he here? Uh listen, buddy. Um That's him. A marshmallow? Do I even like marshmallows? I don't know, do you? Yeah. Stab a marshmallow. Do what he's doing. He ain't say a word. That's terrifying. Okay. <laughs> Roast? Is he gonna stalk? Dad? What are we doing here? Are you trying to tell me something? Huh. What is he up to? I don't understand. This is horrifying. Now, he's not a bad guy, but the fact that he just pops up like he does is freaking horrifying. Amazing, isn't it? Um, I can't look away. It's a fire. Sure. Don't pretend you're not mesmerized too. Destruction? Fire? See? You're so drawn to it, you don't even realize the danger. Danger? 
Fire blinds us, just like darkness. But darkness blinds with absence, with loss. Like the sky is purple of darkness, what the does flames. Fire blind with beauty. Yeah. But sometimes there's a greater beauty yet to come. Incredible. Fire is jealous, Chloe. Uh -huh. It wants all the beauty for itself. That's why you need to be careful. What's that supposed to mean? Careful of what? Hasn't anyone ever told you not to fall asleep with a lit cigarette? You could start a fire. I mean, like the one you started? But that's kind of curious what he said about fire is jealous so, and it burns. It's pretty. In, or what? Uh, of course. I love giving rides to strange drifters. Hop in. <laughs> Thanks. Uh, what is that? Did she really pack her bags? I'm not even sure if that door works. It does! She is so pretty. Yeah, she's really freaking pretty. Damn, you've been busy. It's nothing. Just some junk I found lying around. It looks good. A, towel? a freaky red light. <laughs> Holy shit. The, the all seeing. Y'all see that, right? <laughs> the Illuminati reference. Look! She even said it! <laughs> thinking ahead. <laughs> oh my god. This is incredible. I, I can't believe you found us an escape vehicle already. Mmm. Like, for us to run away? Oh, I, I guess I wasn't thinking about it that way. Are you getting cold feet? I thought you were all bye-bye Arcadia Bay last night. I still am. I guess. You guess? It's not so easy. Yeah, this truck do doesn't even start, and we don't have any money. We can figure all of that out. I have no doubt. Besides, there's no rush. True. And no Blackwell. <sighs> Holy shit. <laughs> that Wells meeting. I'm so sorry. I can't believe he actually expelled you. I could believe it. <laughs> Why not? No See? reason to prolong the inevitable. I mean, it was going to happen sooner or later, right? It's definitely Blackwell's loss. You covering for me was amazing. I don't know how to thank you. <sighs> Whatever. You tried to cover for me, too. Tried and failed. I guess we know who the better liar is. Or maybe my lie was the one he wanted to believe. It was. At least Wells has no idea what really went down with us last night. Shit got pretty wild. Like a fire. Us. Last I checked, you're the one who went all puff the manic dragon on that tree last night. What were you thinking? I was angry. I didn't expect the whole stupid park to go whoosh. But come on, doesn't <laughs> accomplice sound way cooler than accessory after the fact? Uh. <laughs> is that the official Arcadia Bay DA's opinion? Accomplice it is. <laughs> I'd be way happier going to jail than having to live at home with Dick Tater David. Dick Tater David. <laughs> he announced his plans to move in this morning. Oh, Chloe, that's awful. I'm so sorry. You know what we both could use? Therapy. No! <laughs> True. Therapy. Truthfully? You start. Kick back and tell me what's bothering you. Hmm. 
Well, Doc. Uh, David. I mean, There's we already started. This dildo with a mustache who's been dating my mom, and now he thinks <sighs> he's moving in with us. How do I stop him? Hmm. That's a hard one. I'm not sure there's really anything you can do. Then what the hell am I talking to you for? Just because you can't stop him doesn't mean you don't fight back. Mm -hmm. The resistance begins now. Resistance? Alright. You're mean, going to need out. a new nickname to mark your enemy. What have you got? Nickname? <gasps> step douche! He's, uh, step douche. Because he's inserting himself where he doesn't belong. Also, also in kid. Life is Strange, that's what she called him. Poetic. Step douche. May I also suggest step ladder? Why step ladder? Something he can get over? Because he climbs on your mom every night. Oh! 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 Pretty soon, they'll be stepping down the aisle. What the hell kind of therapy <laughs> are you? Stepping Sorry. down the aisle. It's called shock therapy. Highly controversial. Okay. Hmm, Blackwell? I mean, why not? I've been booted from school, and I'm not entirely sure what to do about it. You mean how to cope with your feelings of anger and disappointment? No. I mean, how to express my feelings of intense joy. <laughs> she is uh -huh. definitely... Do you think you might be taking this a little too well? <laughs> tell me. I'd say I'm exceptionally well-adjusted. I'd bet my therapist's license that no one's ever called you that before. <laughs> Touche, Doc. Okay. Fire. So, my new friend, who everyone thinks is perfect, did something batshit fucking nutso last night. What do I do? This perfect friend of yours, who I'm assuming is also an exceptional beauty, she sounds is. like she may have been inspired by someone new in her life. Someone who is also, may I add... A knockout in the looks department. Uh. <laughs> Perhaps this friend of yours, who, I reiterate, must be just stunning, <laughs> needs someone in her life to teach her. How to steal wine from yuppie picnickers. Which was bad, How by the way. How not to give a fuck. Because she was tired of having to give so many fucks all the time. That makes sense. Makes adequate sense. That was actually somewhat therapeutic. Thank you. It's always a pleasure delving into the mind of Chloe Price. And now it's your turn. Tell me all about what it's like being daughter of Arcadia Bay's most famous scumbag. Scumming famous scumbag. It sucks. Well, I'm sure. Too blunt? Sorry. I do that sometimes. Nah, I'm just... Ugh, I don't know. Can we talk about something else? Of course. Uh... Truck! Talk about the truck! We didn't talk about the truck yet! It's the truck a bit. That might mean I have life skills. Something I've really tried to avoid. Upshot, I'm closer to becoming a car thief. That's pretty badass. It is. Car thief! Do you think there's a point when you've been acting so much that you don't even have your own personality anymore? That You're seems like Persona 4 with that girl. I you to be. forgot her name. Ray, uh, shit, I, I think you have a personality. I wasn't talking Rise, about Rise Kujigawa, or whatever her name is. My dad doesn't really exist. You saw him in Wells' office. The whole thing is a performance. And now I'm starting to feel like everything in my life is bullshit. But he's still my dad. How can I make sure I don't end up like him? Hmm. Well, for starters, you're not like him. And secondly, I won't let you. You just need someone around who likes you for who you are and isn't afraid to call bullshit when needed. Uh-huh. Let me know if you find any candidates for the job.
shit. It's time for the play. As if my life didn't have enough drama in it. Good luck. You know you're never supposed to tell an actor good luck before a show? It's bad luck. You're supposed to say How break a leg, right? telling someone good luck, bad luck? <laughs> it's you're an old saying. To say, break a leg. Break a leg! There it is. Bad See? Bad. I told y'all. Hey. I, I was thinking that after the show, maybe we could go do something. Just you and me. Like hang out in the car? Criminal. Criminally fun. <laughs> I'm in. Wait, you forgot your bag. It's for you. Huh? Just a little survival kit for your new life on the lamb. Drive safe, Chloe. <laughs> oh. Okay. Hello, junk shack. That's a nice shot. It'll protect you from the rain a little bit, but rain will still seep in and like make all your shit wet. <laughs> Mikey. Time to check out Rachel Amber's mystery bag. Okay, well give me a second. Dear Max, Dad got me in a state. Oh, it's put your thoughts in me. Now this is more like here. I'm right to you all. I'm all wondering if you were around me, bat me one day when you return home and apologize for having forgotten all about me. And we kiss and make up. I'll show this to you and we can read it and laugh. Or well, maybe. Oh my God, why am I doing? I'm skipping all the shit. Okay. We could hang this tapestry? What? Let's hang it up. Shit. Yes, sir. I ain't gonna question how fast she did it. I'm gonna let it go because it's a video game. It's time to talk about the elephant in the room. This this elephant fucking, elephant it does. Fucking rules. Turn that shit off. Thank you. That shit's still playing. Okay. Hang this up. This is starting to look at the junk shack like... I've play, I was into in part one. Like, when you came to the junkyard, it's literally set up the same way. It's I really think that that's really cool how they did this. I really do, personally. Okay. Alright. Alright, we hung that up. What we got? Oh my god, stop. Um, a sign? Prop up, too. Why not? Let's prop all this stuff up before we open the mystery bag, y'all. Shit, let's do it. Wrong way. <laughs> So anybody who stumbles upon the secret junk shack will go the other way. Okay, is that everything? I feel like that's everything. The this radio. place is the shit. It is. It's like my junk fortress of solitude. It is. It's nice. All right, let's uh, check what she got in this bag. A bag full of clothes. Uh, I mean, they're different than what she's currently wearing. Yes, I need those. You do. All right. Let's try on some clothes. <laughs> Nothing like an abandoned shack in the middle of a junkyard to make a girl feel like exploring a new wardrobe. <laughs> I mean, that's true. Raven hair? Oh, Raven. That's what that bird was. I had a feeling it was. I kept calling it a crow. Nobody corrected me. Nice. And the hat I got out of the clock. That was what it was! A hat! Can I change again? I wonder. Nice. But I, 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 I like the one with the hat. I can't, I can't, like, I gotta have the hat. I feel like I like the hat. Chloe was here. Yep, and then there was one where I think Amber put hers there too. That's pretty cool. At least that's what I was when I played um, as Max in the first game. All right, y'all, I'm going to end it here. That was some more Life is Strange Before the Storm, Chapter 2. Um, I had a blast. We explored more of the junkyard, got a car set up, saw a creepy-ass image of the pops, and it's crazy. It's crazy. I love this game so far, and I hope you guys love it with me. I really do hope you guys love it. Um, keep showing the love and support. And I'll see all of you guys in the next gameplay. Siphon. Logging out.